Oh yeah, you like that music? Well, you should, because it's from Montreal-based Alpha Boys, who inarguably are the most exciting thing going on in hip-hop right now. Alpha Boys consists of two members, Steve-O and J.O.S., hard-working, talented, and ambitious men who have been working together since 2002. They were originally known as Crazy Block in Florida, which at that time consisted of D-Money and brothers Steve-O and J.O.S. In the summer of 2002, Smithy, a member of the production team, decided to invest his money into the group and purchased the studio equipment they needed to be able to start recording their first single, We Beat at the Club. Since the creation of Alpha Boys, these men have been working hard to continue providing their fans with creative and positive music that can reach out to the most die-hard hip-hop fan to the everyday music listener. They've also traveled within the USA and Canada promoting and performing their wonderful work, and I'm pleased to have Steve-O and J.O.S. in studio with me. Welcome to the show, guys. Thank you. Thank you. How are you? Folks, these guys are so cool. we have we got to put them on our, web, our website because they're too cool for my taste here as they're laid back. <laughs> First of all, congratulations. The CD title is called Resurrection. Uh, congratulations. I like your sound. Tell us a little about the journey. I mean, you've come a long way. Florida to here. Wow. Normally people do Montreal, Florida, but you guys decided Florida to here. <laughs> well, the reason we decided to take it this route is because in the state there's so much competitions and over is so much more easier to get to make it mainstream. So that's the reason we decided to take it that route. Mm -hmm. And things are going good so far. So it's nope. a good look. The less competition, the better. What do you think of, of uh, so many artists now are, are doing duets with like big time s stars? Uh, and uh, you know, I mean, I, I think of Jay Z and and because you, you compare your sounds to Lil Wayne, mm -hmm. and, and so on, and uh, Drake. Uh, what do you think of it? I mean, they're branching out. It seems, aren't they? Going into duets with these big time time stars. I think of Alicia Keys, and I think of the the Jay Zs, mm -hmm. and then I think of. Uh, you know, other rock, Snoop Dogg does duets and all that. You guys have decided to, you're a duo, mm -hmm. and you're going to keep it that way, we hope. Well, for now, we're yeah. going to keep it that way. But uh, seriously, like, a lot of people do uh, duets or whatnot, uh, featuring and all that. A lot of people do that just to come up. But us, the way we are, we don't think we need to have any feature to come up, you know, since uh, whatever we have already is already nice. And we're on uh, the level of most mainstream artists and so we think we can do it on our own and, and that's why we're pushing that yeah a lot of people say hip-hop music is rebellious music would you agree people are crying out people are like you know stomping and all that I, th I think it's interesting music and all that but how would you categorize your brand of music of course you know my music the best music in the world I'll put, I'll put it yeah. like that yeah. you know but as far as as being uh, rebellious music I, I think they're wrong totally wrong about that because I mean okay a whole lot of people listen to hip-hop because of the music but then again you know that there's the lyrics also and us we mainly focus on the on the lyrics and if you listen to our stuff you know compared to a whole lot of other artists out there you know it's really good music you know, I can compare it to anything, country, rock, you know, or... And, and it has that dance groove in it, doesn't it? You guys, oh, yeah. want, pe you guys want people on the dance floor, right? We want people on the dance floor, like all the techno clubs, rock and roll clubs. <laughs> <laughs> we just want everybody to be dancing. So where do you guys draw your inspiration from? I mean, uh, your backgrounds, uh, uh, is it obviously love stories, and girls that you know? <laughs> but it's a whole lot of, you know, a little bit of everything. <laughs> <laughs> What type of upbringing, up, upbringing did you guys have? I'm sorry? Childhood and all that. Oh. Was your, are your parents kind of, obviously they're supportive because you wouldn't be here. Whoa. Or, or oh, that's a whoa. Yeah. Oh, okay. Oh. We have Christian Christian parents. Hence the rebelliousness in the music. They, <laughs> they don't support at all. Really? You, you never performed your music at church? Oh, no. <laughs> <laughs> they would not agree with that. Come on. I'm sure you can have some minister say, hey, why not? Alpha boys. On a Sunday morning? I mean, yeah, we can do that as long as we throw Jesus in there. Then well, yeah, <laughs> you can adapt. No, yeah, start definitely. with Oh Lord, you know. <laughs> oh Lord, really? Hallelujah. Yeah. <laughs> so it, w it was rough. Uh, your, your your parents obviously weren't supportive, uh, Steve. Still not supportive. Still not supportive to this day. No. Why is that so? What What are they saying to you? Uh, apart from the fact that guys, it's very competitive. You really think you can carve a career in music when so many artists are out there already? I mean, that's obviously the normal and the constant argument they're going to make, but mm -hmm. what's been going on? Why do, why do you feel they don't support you? 
Well, me personally, first off, my dad want me to be a pastor. So uh, I think that's the number one reason why he doesn't support me. <laughs> they, they believe really uh, in the gospel, and you know, if we don't do music that has to do with the Christian world, then we shouldn't do it at all. That's that's the way they see it. But how do they feel now? Now that you've had success, here you have you're launching a CD. I mean, it's out there. It's called Resurrection. I mean, there is a religious. <laughs> there's a wonderful religious symbolism attached to it. You should be proud of you. Yeah. No. Partially, partially. Gosh, these are tough <laughs> folks. It what is, are their names? Okay. Let's let's extend a welcome to them. What, what's your mom's name? Oh, uh, should do that. Is she, <laughs> no, is she no. listening out there? Is she in Montreal? She, no, she's in Florida. Actually, well, Florida. they beam, we, we get beamed in Florida. Yeah. She, why don't you give her a shout out? Then oh. we'll change her mind. <laughs> Big shout out to my mother if you're listening right now. If you're just lame. You know <laughs> That's you are. <laughs> We're having like a confessional here on the show. <laughs> and my That's dad's also. Okay. <laughs> yes. Yes. <laughs> Yeah, to the parents of Steve-O, if you're listening out there in Florida, uh, you know, come on, support the boys. They're, they're doing good, and they're staying out of trouble here in Montreal, and they're a fixture on the local hip-hop scene. There, I said it. <laughs> J-O-S, first of all, that name, J-O-S, yeah. J.O.S. Yeah. Gosh, clearing customs must, must be interesting for you, isn't it? <laughs> <laughs> what does that mean, J-O-S? Jaws? Jaws or, I, I, you can say it however you want to, but it, it just means my full name, that's it. Okay. Like, I don't know. You want me to say my name? I'll, I'll yeah, put it out there like yeah, that. Me, the, yeah. the, the J's for Jude, and then the O's for Ovid. Don't know where my parents got it from. And then the S is my last name. Oh, cool. Jude. Jude's <laughs> yeah. a cool name. Yeah, it is. Yeah, the Beatles sang, hey, Jude. I know. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> so listen, guys. The album is, is coming out on April 17th. These boys are called Alpha Boys. Look for the title. It's called Resurrection. This, by the way, is a wonderful groovy tune. What are we listening to here? This I know, what you, I know like. what you like. This is I know what you like. The first single of the album. Um, right. We're actually shooting a video tonight. Okay. We're gonna have the video, and it's gonna be airing on Much Music and all the mainstream stations in Canada, yeah. and also the states. So well, it's listen, a big look. Absolutely. I want to say good luck to you guys. Uh, not that you'll need it because you're both very talented individuals. Is there is there a website that the fans can uh, look for you at? Right now, it's just MySpace. MySpace. <laughs> yeah, MySpace.com slash. The Alpha Boys, D E Alpha Boys with a Z. There you go. Thank you, boys, so much. Thank you very much. More of Alpha Boys.